My name is Corey Fields. Um, I'm from Brookings, South Dakota, and I like to hunt, fish, golf, hang out with the family. So I was out pheasant hunting and stepped in a badger hole and ruptured my Achilles. Close to five months, uh, I sort of tried to play the old tough guy role and uh, pawn it off as a sprained ankle type situation. Just wasn't getting better and uh, talked to some people and um, so yeah. I'm a referral from a friend that uh, had seen Dr. Harrell and had uh, similar surgery. Had a plan from the start um, as far as pre-op and then post-recovery uh, was just spelled it all out and gave me the confidence to say that it was really easy to go with him because um, he had, you know, sort of knew what he was doing. I did an x-ray first, he really couldn't tell, so we did do an MRI and then it was pretty evident that uh, I had ruptured some of them area of the area of the of the Achilles. Typically it detaches from the heel, mine didn't, but the strands that did rupture actually turned back up and my scar is actually about four centimeters higher than it should be because he had to go higher to cut them off because they had reattached to my calf muscle. I think the convenience of uh, knowing that post-op and pre-op, um, you know, it's five blocks from my house. And so with the surgery, uh, typically if you go outside of Brookings, uh, Sioux Falls, Mayo Clinic, Minneapolis, whatever, um, wherever North Oak Clinic would be at, um, you're looking at a lot of time away. I mean, just trip to Sioux Falls, it's two hours out of your day um, that you don't get back where this is, you know, five blocks from my house. I'm a little nervous, but you, you, you know, you check in and they explain everything in detail and it um, calms your nerves and puts again that confidence back in you that not only does Dr. Harold know what's going on, but I mean from the minute you walk through the door till you walk out the door that um, they, they do a great job of explaining everything. It's very clear, precise. Um, if you have any questions, they get you an answer. Um, so yeah, it's pretty easy, simple. I think situation when people are um, clear about what's going on. Oh yeah, like I said, fantastic. Um, whether it's Nestis or you know Nestis nurse that was there or whatever, um, and the nurses afterwards um, in recovery, um, again tried to sort of play the tough guy card, and he said I could go home, but he wanted to manage the pain overnight, and again I would. You know, I would let people know that if you think you're tough, you really aren't that tough when it comes to pain. So, um, and of course, when the anesthesiology did wear off, then of course, he did have to come manage some pain. So, when you think you're at home, you're, it's going to be an easy deal. It's not. So, yeah. Real professional. Um, it's close to home. Um, I know um, that they're just trying to do a really good job. Of, getting really good care and making it local so um, I know maybe 10 years ago 20 years ago um, people's thought process was I gotta go to Sioux Falls to get good care I gotta go to Mayo Clinic or Minneapolis and um, that's just not the case it's in your backyard you just gotta search for it. So. Are you one of Brookings Health System's grateful patients who would like to give back to us? Learn more about how you can give back at brookingshealth.org slash my thanks.